<laughs> the squash are so big, Inca's scared of them. <laughs> oh, they're scary, are they? Oh, that's too funny. <laughs> Oh, Inca, I'm sorry I am laughing at you because that's so funny. Are they scary? Are they scary? If I roll it, is it going to be scary to you? <laughs> the first time I've grown these squash and they're so big. She's scared of it. She thinks it's alive. Oh, that's too funny. <laughs> very worried that it's going to pounce on her or eat her because it's bigger than her. Are you okay, pup? Is that scary? Well, that's today's harvest. Three huge squash. These squash here, they're really, all of them actually, are really, really good uh, sliced and diced and roasted or scrummy. And then here are my beans. And they're all growing here in this garden part of the garden and um, it's my own manure and it's my mulched barns when the horses and sheep are lambing and everything so they'll be very healthy from the microbial life that are in these beds which come from the manure heap of well rotted manure straw and wood chip so they're really big. I mean, that's huge. That is huge. But it is so good. I love roasting them in the oven and putting them in soup and all kinds of things. So you can see this is the big yellow squash. Still producing some blooms. Then this is corn here. This maize corn is bodacious. That's the name of it. My friend Susan got me these seeds when she was in the States. So hopefully I will have bodacious corn. And you can see there's the beginning of the cobs. We might be late, but we're trying. There's a whole series of cobs forming, sort of forming. So hopefully they weren't sown too late and will produce delicious corn on the cob. You're not scared of them anymore. Oh, good. They don't scare you anymore. It's very scary, big squash. Yeah, they're so big. <laughs> Poor Inca Dinka do. It's frightening to have such big vegetables on the farm. Is that going to frighten you? Doesn't frighten these guys. These guys can't be bothered. Whereas Inca is still very curious about these squashes. Okay, now to carry them into the kitchen. <laughs> 